Tonight we want to introduce you to a very special member of our team here at New 6. In her first year of college, she lived through Hurricane Maria and recently became an intern in our studio. In fact, she is behind the camera as we speak, Ginger. She is. It's very yeah. impressive, right? Morning anchor Kirsten O'Connor shows us how she is getting results for your health. Maria Ocasio is a Girl Scout, a college student, and a new member of the new 16. 15? Less than a year ago, she watched Hurricane Maria tear through her neighborhood in Puerto Rico. Just seeing that this was the actual first time that a hurricane that magnitude hit the island, um, it was really difficult to just find a way to recover that fast because no one knew how hard it was going to be. That would, that hurricane caught us by surprise. She had to leave because her mother has multiple sclerosis and needed medical help. She didn't have a, her medicine for a long time and that could lead to her going to the hospital. But right now she's getting her medication after six months. But her mom's battle with the disease is not new. It took six years for doctors to diagnose her with MS. And in the four years since her diagnosis, Vilmarie has been working to raise awareness about the number of people in Puerto Rico suffering from the autoimmune disease, even taking her cause to the governor and passing a law to create a registry there. She says her goal is to be that support for people going through the same fears her family initially felt. I know it's really hard. I know it's like long nights just thinking of what's going to go next. And especially if you don't know the condition. And since then, she's created a nonprofit organization, winning awards from national and international foundations. And in college, she's taking media classes to defend her cause. And the fluency actually came when I came here to the United States, when I joined the radio station. And when I started talking with people, I started progressing by that. But you've only been here for 10 months. <laughs> Now, she's getting results for your health. And I saw it as a big opportunity because it's for growth as a young woman and I can see what other opportunities are in the media field. So I signed in and from a lot of applicants, I was one of the chosen ones and I end up at, here at New 6. Kirsten O'Connor. Good. Nice. Thanks, Vilma. <laughs> New 6. <laughs> like, those, like those white chucks. Wow, so if you yeah. want to share Ville Marie's story with your friends, we have it on clickorlando.com. Just go to the Getting Results tab. And I mean, I feel like I need to do more with my life because yeah. she's just starting out and has done all of that already. And she is, she is in studio with us right now. So it's really nice to see that. And she really is making a huge difference in the, the lives of people. Makes yeah. me so proud. Doesn't and, it? Like we just met her this summer, but I feel like I own her. Like she's my fourth daughter. <laughs> You know, like she's out. That's awesome. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you're like a proud papa. I had no idea. See, you only know what you know. And we've talked about the hurricane extensively. Yeah. So I know all about that because you know, she and I have talked about it. I know she lives you know, at college where she goes. But she but doesn't had, brag about all the other right, stuff she I does. I had no idea you. Let me tell you, if I, if that were me, you would know. Uh, you'd have a tattoo. <laughs> <laughs> For oh sure. God.